Hello there my dear friends, this is Armenian King and I'm gonna cast a replay of Rome to Total War Online Battle between Armenia and Parthia. This was one of the most popular matchups in Rome to Total War and I think it's gonna be one of the most popular in popular matchups in Rome 2 as well. And let's see how this goes. I've got two noble horse archers and my opponent has got four mercenary formation horse archers these guys have awesome armor and they are not really easy to kill even with heavy shots so I'm gonna harass my opponent kill some of his noble blood horsemen and he's bringing his two of his horse archers behind me to harass me from behind Let's uh, take a look at what I've got. I've got four units of noble spearmen. Yeah, you may say these guys are not really cost effective, but they are not really bad. They are uh, they are okay for their price, and I I want to bring something different. I I know that Persian hoplites are more cost effective and. Some say that these humans are useless and act, 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 but I want to use any unit that is available in this game to use them properly and gain victories with them. Uh, here my horse archers are pretty much easily winning the, miss, uh, the skirmishing. I've got four noble spearmen, four hillmen, four eastern cataphracts, Three Eastern Archers, two Eastern Spearmen, which are a really good throwaway tool against these mercenary formation horse archers. And my opponent has got five Parthian swordsmen, one Royal Cataphract unit, or two Eastern Cataphracts, two two. Noble Blood Cav and probably four or five Persian archers. And I have already mentioned that he has got four Sarmatian horse archers. Mm. What I'm trying to do is to damage their armor and health with horse archer they will get weaker in melee later so I can win them these human are for temporary holding this Parthian swordsman and let's see how they can do uh, I can uh, how can they do that and These guys can be really annoying. Fortunately, I've killed one here. This one is almost dead. This one has lost 12 men and this one has lost 8 men. But I think my Eastern Spearmen can hold them for a while. Not push them uh, f uh, far from here. Let's see, my opponent is advancing. I must turn my archers like this. I don't know why these Persian light archers are considered to be medium missile unit and my eastern archers are light. Here goes a very good charge while this noble blood cap unit was standing so they will lose tons of men and I hold his royal cataphracts with my eastern cataphracts and I'm gonna support cave fight with some spearmen my human fight with this Parthian swordsmen here they I I don't expect them to do much but they can temporarily hold them there 
Okay, here goes another charge. Kev charging your right flank. My horse archers are c coming to catch and kill these Persian light archers in melee. Um, here I'm winning Kev fight because my charge was good. And I'm supporting with Spearman in here. The Parthian player uh, avoids melee fight with my Spearman and my, and my Eastern Cataphrax. Meanwhile, my archers are killing, uh, are shotting these guys and killing them pretty well. My hillmen are wavering. Here, my heavy horse archers cut down these Persian light archers. Parthian, one unit of Parthian swordsmen are wavering because my archers focus fire on them. My Eastern Spearmen waver because they have some crappy morale. This looks pretty much in my favor, I think. Yeah, I take away my cap from here. My Spearmen can hold these guys for a while and I can bring my cap uh, to support my archers, to protect my archers. Here I kill this general with my cataphracts. And I pr will probably bring cataphracts, this cataphract unit here to protect my archers. Because if I lose my archers, I can lose this. Because he has more infantry. Yeah, he catches my Eastern Cataphrax with his own Eastern Cataphrax. First of all, I need to protect my archers, then kill his cav, then kill his infantry with my cavalry. Yeah, these guys are, are outnumbered here and are gonna die. Here, fight goes on between Noble Spearman and Parthian Swordsman. Parthian Swordsman will probably win it. Although they are cheaper, still they are swordsmen and noble spearmen are spearmen. Mm. Charge like this would be awesome. I don't uh, really remember if I did it. Let's see. Yeah, I actually did it. And let's see how many men this Parthian swordsman lose. 102 and they become... 96. 97 yeah not really as great as I expected here another charge will go with this uh, Eastern cataphracts let's see with trample I hope yeah with trample and these guys are gonna die in seconds rear charges are always very very effective I don't know if these guys have ammunition. No, probably they have no ammunition. So better go and catch some missile units with them. Here, my spearmen. Yeah, they are losing, but it's not. What the? What the? F ah. How this? Ah. Okay, okay. They lost their morale because all of their friendly units were wavering. If not their friendly units, a uh, Parthian swordsman would win those Nova Spearmen. Now let's take a look what we have got here. As you can see, these heavy horse archers are super effective. Some say that was them mean to bring. Uh, those heavy horse archers, uh, horse archers must be fast, mobile, but um, cheap horse archers, which are very fast, are very, very vulnerable to enemies' missile attacks. And these guys are not, and these guys can be a, a pretty decent melee calf in the end, and they kill. Missile units way easier than light 
reinforced archers, they can even lose to Persian light archers in melee. And yeah, these guys were the decisive factor of my victory, I, I guess. And these guys didn't do that much. You see those skills, these skills, these skills are too low for their price, but they they actually hold uh, pretty well. They just uh, waste the air. They just keep this uh, swordsman busy, which were way cheaper than them. But still, not uh, the tactics work. But these guys didn't kill that much. That's all for now, guys. Thank you for watching, and see you later.